हेलो आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन वेलकम बैक टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल एंड टूडे आई विल बी शोइंग यू हाउ एम वन टी आर मशीन इज दिस इज एम वन टी आर मशीन एंड वी विल बी ड्रिलिंग द होल जॉब एंड आई विल बी शोइंग यू हाउ अ ड्रिलिंग प्रोसेस इज डन ऑन एम वन टी आर मशीन एज वेल एज फ्यू स्टेप्स आई विल बी शोइंग यू ऑल्सो सो दिस इज एम वन टी आर मशीन दिस इज द ड्रिल ऑफ एट एम एम एंड दिस इज अ कोलेट एंड विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस डी आर ओ कंट्रोल पैनल वी वी आर एडजस्टिंग द एक्सेस ऑफ द जॉब एंड दीज आर द लिवियर्स दिस इज द कूलेंट विच आई विल बी यूजिंग वाइल डूइंग द ड्रिलिंग प्रोसेस दिस इज द आई विल शो यू वन रॉ द फाइनल प्रोडक्ट दिस इज द फाइनल जॉब लाइक दिस वी हैव टू डू आई विल शो यू दिस इज द रॉ मटेरियल which don't have right now the drill drill part and the thing here is the complex part over here is both the diameters the inner diameters are different so with, with the help of two drill bits tri, uh, two drills we will be doing this application this process uh, first of all we use the 8 mm drill bit and now i will uh, start the my, the process first of all the machine is stopped right now i will put the forward drilling part and then with the help of low there are two speeds actually two rpm we can adjust with the help of there are, there is one high speed as well as the low speed so with the help of low speed first of all we have to point uh, a, a drill point on the jaw and then we have to check the length so let's get started so low i will turn on the light okay the this part is this lever is the brake just a simple drill point and i will check the length with the help of vernier caliper so here a total digitalized numbers are there so whenever i do some axis change it occurs in that uh, display so with the help of this vernier caliper i am going to measure it so 19.10 and it's according to the design geometry designs so yes uh, i will again put the forward option and low and then get started with the drilling slowly with the help of 8 mm drill so you can see the how uh, the digits are changing slowly i will apply the force and the drilling part is is in process this is kind of accurate drilling and there are there are many options for this machine like vertical drilling machines are there and smaller machines are also there which can drill vertically but this is most precise drilling this is most uh, precise drilling machine uh, on which we can uh, like precisely drill so while drilling also we have to lift the drill this uh, like lift up because the scrap gets uh, the the scrap gets inserted into the job so we have to lift up and then again drill so like this the job also gets a fine cutting like lift up and then again pull down this is a simple process but the job the jo it depends on the job because uh, for various jobs uh, we have to adjust the axis the arrow axis there are many options over there and slowly slowly we have to put the coolant over the job
I would like to tell you the types of scrap also. There are different types of scrap while doing the drilling process. And when I will use the next paper drill, that time uh, I will show you the scrap. So yeah, we are done with the drilling operation of 8mm drill bit. I will stop the machine, pull up the lever and yes, we are done with the 8mm drill part. You can show here. So I will remove the scrap of this part. You can see here. This is the brake lever and I will remove the part. This is the collet, the drill part. Like this. This is the trapper drill of and the collet of 1314. Nut. This is a simple nut. And like this, I have to just adjust it. Press forward so that it adjusts. So I will tie it with this part tool. This is the taper drill and I will again start with the we have to bring up till 74 so this is the reading scale and we have to pull the lever up to 74 so let's get started forward to low uh, this scale is usually used to uh, like if you want to have a depth of 5 mm this scale is used because if we want 5 mm thickness drill of 5 mm then up till 5 where to bring it 0 to 5 so I will start with this I will take the coolant part I will start this everything is all right and continuously where to spray the coolant over the job because it gets heated so I have brought up till 50 mm and still 74 is there so I brought till 60. Seventy and last four mm is left. Hmm? So we are completed with this drilling part and drilling process and here we go I will remove the scrap yes uh, I wanted to show you the different types of scrap so this is the turning scrap you can see the scrap is turned over each other and this is the boring scrap the small parts the small small uh, wraps are there this is the boring scrap 
it also uh, the cnc uh, machine makes a lot of scrap that is turning scrap and yeah so i will measure the uh, measure the job i will measure the id and here is the vernier caliper okay Twelve point five one. Uh, this is the tool to remove the jaw. I will insert here. This is the trapezoidal screw. This is the gauge. The main, the main requirement of the industry was. to pass this gauge into the job so we will check it so i can show you samay uh, i can show you wait oh, see there are two different diameters this is the smaller one and this is the larger one so this collet the taper like collet should pass from and should go uh, should Uh, the taper job should pass from larger uh, diameter and should match here that's how the requirement was of the industry this is the final job and we have successfully done this i hope you like this i will share some few information about this m1 tro machine also i will upload in the next video like uh, such information related to Uh, what is the requirements how many axes uh, uh, this machine has and what is the costing of this machine the light bill uh, how much it consumes as well as uh, how which types of tools are required the coolant as well as i would like to make a brief video on this and yeah, i hope you like this video give a thumbs up and thank you for watching the video thank you very much